What's up everybody? Welcome to the YouTube channel. If you are watching this on YouTube, you can go ahead and skip to about the three minute mark. Uh, that's where we're going to get started in today's video, but we are playing Multiverses. I finally got my hands on a code, so stay tuned for that. We'll get started in just a few minutes here if you're watching on Twitch. Um, yeah, hang tight. We'll be, we'll be there in a second. What's going on, everybody? Welcome to a very special Sunday stream. I don't normally do streams on Sunday, but today I got my hand on a alpha code for Multiverses, and I've been looking forward to playing this game for a while now. I've really wanted to play it, and it looks awesome. I, I did the tutorial, and I've kind of played around a little bit with Wonder Woman, but I want to kind of get in there and just fight some people, and I guess learning as you go is not the best strategy for any fighting game, but... Uh, I just I've been wanting to play for so long so I think it's a very good time to start so welcome to the stream if you're catching this impromptu Saturday stream live that's awesome if not that's fine too if you're catching this on YouTube make sure you hit like and subscribe um, do all kinds of Nintendo content and other games as well this game will not be on the switch though unfortunately not for a while um, which I'm fine with I think I think the Switch has Smash, and you don't really need to compete with that on the Switch. Um, but, yeah, I think it's, uh, so far from what I've played, the the maybe 20 minutes of, of uh, practice that I had, uh, it's, it's pretty cool, and it looks amazing. So I'm very excited to get into it and play some games. Hopefully you all are excited to see them. And let's go ahead and get things started. For real, for real. Yeah, it's kind of a, um, so it's kind of a impromptu thing. I didn't really plan on streaming anything today. I was just going to hang out, um, you know, and just kind of maybe play some World of Warcraft or, you know, I have nothing on my schedule today. Usually I put out a schedule, but I didn't really do anything like that today. So I just kind of, I'm winging it today. So this just happened to fall into my lap and that's what we're doing. So, uh, let me bring up the green screen. That might be the best way to enjoy this. Fighting in multiverse. Yes, that is correct. Molt, what's up? What's going on? Welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. All right, I'm just going to go ahead and get started. I'm just going to fight. I've been playing a little bit with um, Wonder Woman. I don't really know what I'm doing. There is like a whole battle pass and everything too, so it's like 
is kind of is interesting. So I think I think they have something here. I, I've been talking about it on Twitter, um, kind of here and there. But I I do think they have something special with this game, and. We'll see how it goes. But I want to be some Wonder Woman. Hold on. Crossplay. It's fine. She's a tank? I don't have any skins. I guess there's taunts and stuff. There's emotes. Oh, that's cool. 2D emotes. Weightlifting. Interesting. How's the day going for you, Molt? How are things how have things been? I think Bosk might get on later on and play this game as well. So I think he was talking about having uh, a code as well. So hopefully he does. Um, so we're not doing any kind of ranked games or anything. We're just doing regular matches. Oh, back's worse. Oh, I heard about that. Yeah. Um, that sucks, man. I heard you stretched or something, and then all of a sudden it, it put your back out of whack. Prepare yourself. That sucks. I'm so sorry. I'm sure in a couple days it's gonna feel better, but it's just, it's the worst when you don't even really do anything and your back just starts hurting. It's literally the worst. What do you, I mean, what are you gonna do? Do these Momos really think they can beat us? Momos. Wow. I think I just canceled the uh, the side B or the side the side special into a different one. things do like the so the the buttons in this are like so weird like the jump button is like Right, you can you can dodge too, but the jump button is not a button I would expect to use. Ooh. Every time I've dodged, I've, I've just fallen down. I've gotten hit every time I've dodged. We got it. Nice. We got one. We got one. Desperate. Ah. 
Ah. Ah, no. We'll get him. Whoa. Okay, I bad DI on that one. Oh, almost had that side B, or side special. Got him that time. Woo! Is that neutral special? Is that what I'm doing? Oh, he just, he just fell down. He didn't, he didn't try to recover at all. Cool. That was fun. All right, so we got one. First game, first win against Punkin. Sorry, Punkin. That was fun, though. It's, it's a different, like, I don't know. Like, I've watched, like, two or three streamers, like, play this game. And I've noticed a lot of people just kind of avoiding the Smash comparison, and I don't really know why. Like, it's it's weird to me. It doesn't feel quite like Smash, but it doesn't not feel like it either. I'd say like the attacks, like the, the way, like the feeling that you get when you hit your opponents, that's kind of not like smash but it's it's interesting Prepare yourself. the movement is sort of like it there's no block button there's no grab button so it's really just about like you know i don't want to say mashing buttons but you know pressing buttons um pressing the right buttons at the right time yeah and the basic mechanics basically like you know um Dealing percentage damage. You know. Like dealing percentage and knocking your opponent back. It's kind of, it's the same concept. I need to figure out how to do this lasso. Oh, he, there's a cooldown. That's right. I got him. We're gonna get him. Finn. I thought I had him there. Dang it. The percentages, like, they seem different, though. Like, as far as, like, how, how you kill... KOs and stuff, they seem different. It seems like kill percentages are, they just feel different. Like, it takes a lot more percentage to get a KO. I don't know what that does. I feel like I need to pay attention to what that does. 
Wonder Woman's fun though. Like I, I had a feeling I was gonna like her. She's cool. But I think all the characters kind of are cool. Like I don't think there's any there's any one character that doesn't feel good in this game. Of course I've only played one. What does that do? It is neutral B, okay. Or I guess neutral triangle. Get out of here. That's a KO. We did it! We did it! Whew. The characters are balanced. I don't know about balance. I've heard a lot about, like, Taz being kind of rough. Um, that was cool, though. We leveled up. So every character has a level in this game, too. You get new rewards, new perks. Kryptonian skin. Interesting. This is cool. Yo, I, I think the, the thing about this game that I like is like Smash is fun and like it's a fun game to play and I like going online and trying to get Elite Smash and all that. It's fun, right? But I think what I like about this game is that it's so... Like the battle pass and the experience bar and you know, playing to unlock new things gives you an incentive to play it, you know? Smash doesn't really give you an incentive to play it because there are no skins, there's nothing to unlock. You know, other than characters, which you can do in the single player mode. So, I don't know, I, I feel like it's, uh... It's, it's fun. It's fun. Like, the whole Battle Pass concept, I, I felt like I don't want to have a game like a Smash game with, with microtransactions, but honestly, like, I like the way they've done it. So, yeah, I, I think I think it's going to be an interesting kind of a thing. We'll, get, we'll put that one on. I guess it's the only one I have. Oh, there's there's like team ones too. So I wonder if you can have different like loadouts for different characters. So like there's a couple of like perks there that are like your team like receives reduced damage or reduced knockback if you're near an ally. So I wonder if you can have like different loadouts or if you can just like like maybe i want to play wonder woman in 1v1s but then i'll want to play someone else in 2v2s someone who has like better perks for those kinds of things i don't know bugs bunny I want to try Bugs. He looks like he'd be a lot of fun. I just threw dynamite at him.
There are spikes. I haven't even tried to spike anybody yet. Match point. Match point. I feel like that, that Acme explosion should be a lot bigger. I don't know why. It doesn't have an impact, it seems like. It's very floaty, too. Like, all the characters are very floaty. Spike him. Can I spike him? Woo! Oh, they hit me. <laughs> Dang. That was sick, dude. Her up air just like spiked him onto the ground and knocked knocked him into the air. It's weird not having a, a block or a grab though. I think it makes the game a lot more simple, like simplistic as as far as like Smash or whatever, but yeah, thank you so much, Boss, by the way, for getting me a code. It's fun. It's fun, but it's different. Choose your character. It's not bad. It's, it's just different. Also, on PlayStation, there seems to be a bit of a stalling, like in the menus and stuff. It seems like it's a little slower. This might be a game I have to play on PC, but uh, it is it is cool. Garnet. I've only played one character so far. I have no idea who else. Like, I've seen a lot of the game. Like, I've watched people play Bugs, and I've watched people play um, Shaggy a little bit. Of course, you, the tutorial is with Shaggy. Um, there's Garnet in the corner. You can't see her, though, because my, my camera was blocking it. But, yeah, so... I kind of want to play everybody in this game. <clears throat> but Wonder Woman's pretty fun. I wonder how to combo into that. I have to remember that she goes a different way. That's the first time he's hit me is with that pie. Woo! Hey, so John, what's up? Welcome to the stream.
Whoops. Whoa. Right in the kisser. Classic Bugs. Classic Bugs Bunny. Dude, imagine like Animaniacs being like a Ice Climbers kind of a thing with like three characters to play. Or like a Pokemon Trainer kind of a thing. I can't block. Dead. Got him. Her crouch, she crawls around trying to find her glasses, and the screen goes blurry for the player. Animaniacs, Freakazoid, Pinky in the Brain. Heck yeah. All of those. Yeah, there is something about her, her losing her, her glasses, I guess, is when she crawls. Um, that bugs wasn't, uh, wasn't very good. I feel bad, but he really wasn't very good. I've won like four in a row. New reward! What do we got? Ooh, a utility perk. Nice. So I think it's like level 10 for every character. I don't know. I forget what the level cap is. This probably needs to be changed though. Maybe if you have the battle pass, you get extra experience. I know you do if, you, if you're playing with other people, like 2v2s. So that's cool. Um, we'll have to get into that. Can I check? There's the battle pass. Damn. Can you not unlock? You should be able to unlock premium, right? Well, I guess it is already unlocked. Okay. Batman's locked. Oh, I guess these are the things you unlock at each level for each character. Level 15. Batman announcer pack? That'd be really cool, actually. There's a... Duh, man, that's so cool. Yeah, that makes sense. With it being on alpha. So I wonder how you, how you unlock him, though. Steven Universe. Let's just play again, I guess. I don't I don't know how to unlock anybody. Do not mistake a desire to avoid the we'll figure it out later. This game may be addicting, yeah. Well it's like it's cool because it's you know, it's got that Fortnite feeling to it where, you know, you have you want to unlock a certain skin for a certain character and they might be at the end of the battle pass for that season, so you have to kind of grind it out. I think it's going to be something that replaces um, Smash Ultimate for me. 
um, on Saturday mornings. But it'll be cool. It's Smash with the Battle Pass, yeah. Which is something that Smash was missing, is like just things to unlock, like just a bunch of stuff to... Like, Smash was missing an incentive to play it. I love it, and it's fun, but there really wasn't any incentive to get in there and play it, especially online. It was just kind of like, hey, here's our game. You know, play it or don't. <laughs> But this game definitely gives you that incentive to play. This guy's unlocked. Batman. They also like make it so you can't spam the same attack over and over again, which is great. Which I'm still doing. Cause I don't give a fuck. This guy's like literally just walking around. He's not even trying to attack me. But if I'm being honest, like, I do think the next uh, Mario Kart's going to do something like that. Maybe not Smash. I think we're looking at a, a long, long time before another Smash game comes out. But I do think Mario Kart's going to do that. Oh, I died. Um, Nintendo themselves? I don't think so. So Batman and Wonder Woman had like a thing in the comics, in the cartoon show. Very abusive relationship, apparently. See him teabagging? You see him teabag before? Like I, I dropped off that ledge and it, like I saw him do a couple of teabags like he thought I was gonna die. He was bringing it back though a little bit. Pokemon Unite, yeah, but it, I wouldn't even say that's Nintendo really. Um, it seems like a different thing. That's five in a row though, guys. That's five in a row. But yeah, I think. Uh, I don't think Nintendo's had their own, like, Battle Pass thing. They probably don't believe in it. I saw a, a tweet today that said, like, Reggie... Reggie had said, like, Nintendo didn't... They didn't, like... What's the word? They didn't believe in the power of... Like, online play? Or they didn't see value in the online market or whatever. Which makes sense. They, they never did anything online. Um, I want to change something real quick. I want to change a setting. But like... It's time to try teams. I could do that. Not yet though. So I want to... 
change my color to that blue color that my channel is known for. That one probably. My ally should be the same color, maybe a slightly different color. Like, I feel like you're gonna know who you are. That's fine. Yeah, that's fine. Although green, maybe for instead of purple. I feel like that's kind of the... Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, they give you some cool options to change the outline color of your character and your teammate and the other the other team as well. One thing I kind of like about this is that you're never going to be in a situation where where you can't really make it back. Choose your character. Um I mean, partially, yes, but you can wall jump, and you can basically infinitely wall jump, so I kind of like that. What's this? Oh, okay. Cool badges. Announcers. That's cool, man. Just, man, the idea of this is so cool. Especially being a free-to-play game. It's just a cool idea, right? I'm very excited. I think this is kind of what I've been looking for. Like, when, when Pokemon Unite came out, I was like, oh, cool. Unite's, like, that's going to be the game that I really get into and, and start playing a lot, and it'll be really fun. And then it wasn't. So, I probably need to skip this song, actually. You don't know what you're in for. Uh... Uh, but yeah, so it wasn't Unite, and that's fine. But this game would be a little better, I think. Because it is skill-based. There's no random element that's going to, like, make or break the game for you. You know what I mean? There's no Zapdos. Woo, look at me go. Oh gosh. Okay. Match point. Red team. There's no Halloween event yet. True.
<laughs> there we go. We nailed it. We got him. I knew that was going to happen. Skill not con still not convinced on the air mobility. Um, air mobility is weird. I feel like you stay in the air for a little bit too long. I don't think it's bad. But... I do feel like there's kind of... There's kind of a, a longevity to how long you can stay in the air. And again, it's not bad. It's just... It's different. I'm trying to think of how to explain it. It's kind of like... If you've ever watched Dragon Ball Fighters, it's kind of like that. Or like Marvel vs. Capcom 3. Kind of like that. Except... Yeah, I would say it's, it's kind of like that. Yeah, you do stay in the air forever. But like in... in in Marvel vs. Capcom 3, you knock your opponent up into the air and then you chase after them. And then you do this like huge combo, but you're like floating up there, stalled. You never actually fall down. Um, I I'd say it's probably a good way to explain it. I didn't hate that. In that game. So I feel like it's kind of good in this one too. But there is a real floatiness to it, too, which I kind of like. He's doing that projectile thing. You think I've never dealt with this before? The thing is, the problem is he can't you can't really do it in this game. Because your some of your attacks have a cooldown. Oh, I can't believe I died. Okay. Alright, last stock. Damn. It's actually working.
so annoying, dude. Like, okay, so I do feel like I can get over... Because he was doing that, that Toon Link crap where you just run side to side, throw projectiles, and try to avoid your opponent. Like, that works really well in Smash Brothers sometimes. It didn't really work in this. And I feel like there's some cooldowns you have to you have to address and some move stalling or staling that you have to address um yeah he didn't uh he wasn't able to play me like that plus i've dealt with it so much in smash i know exactly what to do cool level four level six wonder woman i might try to get her level 12 because she's fun to play she's so fun Lobo would be cool. Choose your character. I feel like there's a lot of characters they can add from DC. Um, but I feel like if they start dipping their hands in the DC uh, chocolate, <laughs> it's, it's going to be a slippery slope if they start doing that. I'd prefer they don't do that, but I don't, I don't really mind. New profile icon? Ooh, let's do that. Where's my profile? I like that one, though. So I've, I've won all my matches. I played, what, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight matches and won all of them? Seven matches. It's cool, man. Yeah, they don't want that franchise to take over. Although I think there's a lot of potential for, like, Steven Universe to have a lot of characters. There's a lot of lovable characters from there. Tiny Toons, Animaniacs, Batman. Um, well, Batman, I guess, is more like... Um, What's the word? Uh, DC. But there's potential is like is crazy. I don't know how to toast another player. What's a ring out? I don't know what that is. Tiny tunes. Boss, what time do you get off work? We need to do some doubles. Oh, it's Taz. Uh, they, they do, kind of. Like, you can... There are... Like, every character has, like, an ability they can use to help their teammate. Whether it's, like, to give them, like... Uh, a stronger attack for a little while or to give them or to like save them from going into the blast zone or something so every character has some kind of thing they can do um, to help their teammate and they also have like unique voice lines they can use uh, with other characters too so He's a monster. That move I heard is pretty rough, but it does have a cooldown. So you can't use it. You can't spam it, although he is doing a fine job of doing that. Why am I a turkey? What do I do? How do I how do I stop being a turkey?
Okay. <laughs> That's how you do that. Why is he invisible? What? Why is he invisible? My God. Why is he still invisible? I don't, what the hell is going on? Why am I a turkey and why is he invisible? That doesn't make any sense. That's gotta be some kind of a bug. Um. Okay. Yeah, it says Taz invisible glitch. Invisible Taz bug. Choose your character. Huh, interesting. Okay, the turkey thing is fine. I don't mind the turkey thing. The invisible thing doesn't make any sense. Um, because I probably could have beat him if I could have seen him, but that's fine. I'm not, I'll take the loss. I'll take the loss. Um, yeah, it was just strange. I don't know. He's always trying to eat things. <laughs> Giving people the salt for, for real, for real. Like that's not even, like that's, that's a very meta thing to give him. God, can I hit her? Let's go, Harley. Okay. Match point. I'm sweating on this one. I'm, uh, what? She's going crazy is all she's doing.
Dang, bounce off the wall. All right. Whew. Um, I'm at that point where I'm getting like, I don't know what that like what was going on there. Just played the game more than me, so I don't really know. I don't know. That was an annoying loss because she was all over the place, but it's gonna happen. It's gonna happen, right? That battle pass takes forever to fill up, though. Jesus. Yeah, the Harley was pretty crazy. I feel like I could have beat her. I think that's the most heartbreaking, heartbreaking thing. Is I, I probably could have beat her. Doubles may fill faster. I don't know if it's really the, the fact that it's not filling very fast. I think it's more about, like... The, the interface is just slow on the PlayStation. That's all it is. Like, getting getting into a game is a little confusing. And I'm sure it'll be a little bit like Fortnite, where as the seasons go on and the game updates, that they'll actually get, like, easier to navigate interfaces, which I think is, like, that's the number one thing in a game. Like, I don't think it's hard to have a clean, easy-to-understand interface. And this one's okay. But I feel like it could be a little a little more simplified. Prepare yourself. That Harley was also level 9. So perks may have played a role in that loss. But I'm, I'm not going to make excuses. It could have been anything. Could have been my lack of knowledge on the game or skill or whatever. So... All right, four ring outs. It's basically a four stock game, but. I can't jump. Thank you. Oh, you're talking about the battle pass. The battle pass might feel faster if I play doubles. Cause I, th I think that is the idea of the game. This garden is killing it right now, though. Harley needs to die. There we go. <laughs> Short work of her. Oh, 
I died. What? No jump? My bad teammate. Ah! We'll get him, we'll get him. Come on, Finn. Where you at? Come here. Or Harley. Whichever. <laughs> Match point. Blue team. Oh, I forgot. There's no... It's like, it's all about, like... The, the team stays. But if we get Finn... Yeah, it's over. We got it. Victory! Ooh, that was fun. <laughs> that was fun. Well, with a good teammate, it's fun. Play again? We both got two. Let's go! Yeah, duh. It's cool, man. This game is just really cool. I will fight for those who cannot fight for themselves. And the visual art style for all the characters is really neat, too. Like, I like how Harley and Wonder Woman look. I think they look really cool. And everyone else looks like they're supposed to, so... I don't know. Prepare! I think they did a really good job with making the characters look like the characters. I think Jake's playable too, right? Finn and Jake? Let's do it, huh? Yep. I never actually saw... Like, I only saw like a few... Um, Adventure Time episodes. It was like Boss showed me them a long, long time ago. Oh, I thought I died. The uh, rollback netcode is kind of strange to get used to when you're not used to it. This Finn's about to die like three times, so he'll probably be the one that loses his uh, 
stock first. Nope, never mind. <laughs> oh, I forgot. I have a, a down special. There's like a lot of mashing right now, but I know that's not always going to be the case. My teammate died? There we go. Victory. I didn't die at all. Mathematical. Oh, he's got like a three hit combo with his skateboard. He can like jump on you three times. And the mathematical quote comes up. That was fun. Let's see. Let's see about this uh, battle pass filling up higher. Oh, I can toast my, I can toast them. I didn't do that. I feel bad now. It's like it's like a thumbs up or whatever. I I didn't do that. It was like it was a little faster. We'll do doubles again. That was fun. I don't know what a ring out is though. Oh, I guess it's probably the uh, the effect that happens. Yeah, right here when you when you die. House Lannister, House Stark, House Tegrin. I don't even want any of these. But we did it. <laughs> New reward. So Boss will tell you this. I'm one of those people in video games like... Oftentimes when there's a currency in a video game, I I don't use that currency. Um, so I've got 2,000 gold. I don't really know what to do with the gold yet. I think you can buy new characters, but I don't know how to do that. So, yeah, we'll see. I'm sure I will use it. I just don't know when. Oh, I got this one now. Stronger than ever. That's when you have... Uh, your team receives armor for five seconds after respawning. Seven seconds if your ally also has the perk. That's cool. I think perks are going to add a layer of death to this game, too. The level four rain dog. Let's target him. That'd be fun. I think you have to unlock Garnet though, which kind of sucks. Fosk wants to play Garnet. Can't do it. Can't do it. Let's do it, Finn. Don't fail me now.
Oh, I think I hit a spike hitbox on that uh, up air. What did I just do? Rain dog is just out of my range here. He's playing full time support. You know, I think if we just attack him, like. Also, can we talk about how it's uh, it's the Batman voice? Like, it's Batman. Conroy? What's his name? Conroy? Kevin Conroy? They have to kill us. Like, they haven't- they've only killed Finn. That's victory, right? Oh, not yet. Oh, jeez. What? I didn't... Oh, I did. I teleported somehow. I don't know how. There we go. So I think they were playing really hardcore support on that with the rain dog. And that's a fine strategy, but you also have to kill your opponents. Like, you can't just rely solely on surviving you have to get KOs and they didn't get any KOs okay. so that's that's odd to me except for Steven yeah I heard that Steven's uh, voice actor uh, yeah yeah my undershirt here is green so it's like it's going through the uh, <laughs> it's it's showing through to the back of the uh, to whatever's behind me. I normally like pay attention to stuff like that, but this time I didn't. It's fine. I don't care. Just deal with it. It's fine. Kevin Conroy, yep. Yeah. Let's go. I don't even know what I was doing, but somehow I was teleporting. And I think you can like hover with her up B, her up special. I don't I don't really know how I did it. But I think you can. Ah. So the, the the game comes out next month, right? I think it's next month.
Nice. Oh, jeez. Oh, I'm gonna die. Crap, knock me all the way down. Match point. Blue team. Nice. Another victory. We are killing it in the doubles right now. Next month is open beta. Cool. Yeah, Finn says that a lot. Get wrecked, nerd. I love it. It's so funny. I think this is how you toast people. There we go. So yeah, you can give people toasts for being good teammates or good opponents or whatever. That's kind of cool. 180 progression level up new reward the whip of Hephaestus Hephaestus I don't know what that means I'm sure Molt knows that's cool yeah the game's fun man it's really cool More gold. Let's see. I can't really unlock the shop right now. Collection. I wonder... I know people have unlocked things. I know people have unlocked Batman. I don't know how, though. Today's mission, seasonal milestones. Get the most ring outs in 50 games. Hephaestus was one of the Greek gods called Vulcan by the Romans and he was the god of fire, blacksmiths, and craftspeople. Cool. Aphrodite's husband, nice. Makes sense why he'd have a whip. So, playing the first knockout strike in two matches. So how come I can't like do these? Twenty-five matches with the Bruiser class character. Two hundred fully charged attacks. Oh man, that's for the whole season though. Twenty full game sets. Mm 
bring out an enemy who's less than 60 damage. Interesting. I have a lot of gold. What's this? Oh. Toast times 10. Unlock with gold. Am I am I using toast to pay for stuff? I don't know what that was. I'm gonna I'm not gonna do it yet. I might do it next. I wanna play some more. Oh, I don't think you've ever met Three assists. First knockback strike in two matches. The lame god since he did have one bad leg. The exact reason depended on the telling of his origin. Yo, we got a Jake. Two Jakes and a Velma. Alright, so what's this do? Ooh, the tip of Wonder Woman's lasso deals a powerful knockback. Let's go. Let's do it. We gotta hit him with just the tip. And you know that people were gonna say that. Don't look at me like that. Don't look at me like I'm crazy. WB knew people were gonna say that. I don't know why they called it that. It's their own fault. That ain't my fault. That's their fault. Okay. And what was my what's my tip button? I can't get down there. There's your Velma. I can't hit anybody. I feel like she's kind of like a, a um, Phoenix Wright type character. Oh dang, she like threw me against that wall, bro. What is that? I died. This team's gonna beat us. Don't target me, bro. Woo. Ah. My glasses! Woo! Okay, we're probably gonna lose this one, guys. Get down there, what are you doing? Oh, we lost. Damn. 
I don't know. That was that was like a louder a louder death animation or a death victory. Not victory, but a death like thing than usual. That was weird. My glasses. I guess we're not rematching because that guy needs to eat. I love that you can rematch. That's cool. And you can change characters after a rematch. God. Like, this game is making me making me remember all the stuff that uh, Smash did wrong. I like Smash Ultimate. But I feel like from an interface standpoint, like from, from being able to play online and, and challenge other people... And just from a from an interface perspective, I think Smash 4 was a better experience with like getting into a match, being able to challenge somebody, change characters whenever you wanted to, continue to fight with that person as much as possible. Like those are the kinds of things I think were cool. Like you could do a best a two out of three, and nobody really cared. Nobody nobody was like, oh, I don't I don't want to do a best two out of three. Because there was no GSP to worry about. And this game lets you do the best two out of three. You can back out if you want to. I don't know, man. Don't get me wrong. I like Smash. But this game is making me remember all, all the reasons I stopped playing it when it first came out. It's still fun. I'm probably still going to play it for a while. But my word. I remember when Smash came out, I, I didn't play it that much. Like, I played it for a little while, and I got so annoyed with the, the stuff, the decisions that they made. Where's Taz? Oh, he's invisible again! He's on my team, though. See, I don't mind so much when he's on my team. I don't like it, but I don't mind. Harley, we'll get her. My God, what did I just do? Visit Taz again. You know, I don't know. Um, I don't know if the Taz player is invisible on the Taz player's screen. They probably just quit though, because I don't know if they'd want to keep going with an invisible Taz, but we did kind of just wreck them at the end there. Yeah, Smash is great. There's a lot of like little things. It, like, and that's all it is. It's just little things um, that they could have done better. And I remember when it first came out, I was like, you know, I can't, I just can't play this. It's not as good as Smash 4, even though everybody's here and I love that everybody's here. I, I can't play it. it. Took me like a year and a half to come around, but I finally did. And I enjoy it now. Um, but when it first came out, I was like, no, this is not as good. It was a step back. But yeah, this game definitely lights a fire under their butts to make the next Smash game better. 
But I don't think we're going to get another Smash game for a long time. I think it's going to be... I want to say a good five years. Because they don't need another one. Not yet. He's already invisible? Are you serious? Dude, I just, I don't know how I killed him. Unless that was Taz that helped me. You can charge that, I didn't know. That's cool. Looks like he's uh, salted him up right nice. I'd be salty too though if I couldn't see him. Nice. Victory. Nice, I had the edge guard. That was sweet, dude. Sweet. I don't like having an invisible teammate, but I like winning. So uh, what do you do, you know? What do you do? I didn't give them any props though. I feel bad. Oh, I guess you have to buy the toast. You have to buy the ability to toast people, I think. Perk training, perk upgrade. Ooh, I wonder what that is. Nice. I saw a couple of my streamer people that I watch play this game for like a good like 12 hours. Uh, when it came out. Perk training allows you to learn and equip new perks that are not available on the mastery track. To see all the new perks you can now learn, each new perk will cost a little gold to learn, but we promise it'll be worth it. If you already know the perk from another character, you even get a discount on it. Ooh. That's interesting. Yeah, I think so too. That might be the ticket. Train perks. Utility. So I guess... Can I learn these? Projectiles do 7% increased damage. 5% increased damage with projectiles. Wait, it's the same thing. Oh, to far away victims, okay. And this one's to normally 5% increased. 5% increased damage with melee attacks in the air. That's not bad. One additional damage when knocked 
when knocked back enemies collide with a wall or floor. Ringing out enemies will, while near the edge of the arena, pushes the attacker back towards the main stage. That's pretty cool. Uh, your team refreshes air special attacks after ringing out an enemy. Your team deals 5% increased damage with melee attacks on the ground. Your team receives 20% increased projectile speed. 7% increased damage against the fighter with the highest damage. Snowball effect, not bad. 5% increased damage when hitting enemies that are in hit stun. Hmm. So more damage on combos. 5% increased damage with attacks that knock back enemies upwards. Interesting. Increased damage with attacks that knock back enemies horizontally. Two stacks of ice debuff if they knock enemies back. Projectiles deal two attacks, two stacks of ice debuff. Uh, for three seconds after knocking back an enemy with a projectile, your team can melee attack that enemy to ignite them for two seconds. After allies remain grounded for seven seconds, their next projectile is empowered with electric damage. 10% increased dodge distance. When dodging out of an attack, hit cancel 0.5 second refund on ability cooldowns after hitting debuffed enemies 5% increased damage when hitting debuffed enemies I think I like the ones that like this one's probably good um it's extra damage with melee attacks in the air. For Wonder Woman, she does melee. She doesn't have a lot of projectiles. Lumpy Space Punch, wow. Yep. <laughs> Far away victims. I don't have projectiles. So it refreshes air special attacks after ringing out an enemy. I guess we'll do that one too. I want both though. Okay. We'll come back to that. And let's see, we got, we get armor for five seconds. We'll do that one instead. Okay, cool. Let's try this out. So I forget what it was already, but I guess it's uh, it's increased damage with aerial attacks. Um, I have a couple that are pretty strong, so I want to I want to use those. So increased damage with aerial attacks, areola attacks. He's got ten percent damage after or er, he deals ten percent increased damage after he reaches a hundred percent damage reduces incoming damage by four percent oh yourself. we got a stacked we got a stacked ability i'm gonna deal a lot more damage with aerial attacks so that's probably the way to go areola attacks yes sir you did hear that i don't, I don't remember who said it though i don't i don't know
We got the Tom and Jerry. Wait, our guy died? Zoinks! Zoinks! Oh, jeez. Got a lot of damage on them though. Why are they going after Shaggy for some reason? They really want to kill the Shaggy. Match point. Red team. We won. Victory. <laughs> nice. That was tight, dude. That was actually fun. I mean, I guess the lore is that Ultra Instinct um, Shaggy is powerful, but they they really didn't need to, to like focus him as as hard as they did. Like I was chasing them down the whole time. I mean, look at my damage; they weren't even touching me. I don't understand. Look at that; we get more battle pass stuff. Tier 1 unlocked. Nice. 50 melee attacks. We'll do that in one in one game, yo. 50 melee attacks? Let's do it. Desi the Fox, what's going on? Welcome to Sunday Chill Stream. We have fired up the multiversus. And it's fun. It's actually fun. It's actually fun. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know how to unlock the characters yet. Um... Garnet and Batman and Superman are all locked, but I know you can play as them. I've seen other people do it. I just don't know how to unlock them. Prepare is it... Yourself. I mean, is it gold or is it, like, real money? I can't even find the menu that lets you do it. Yeah. But right now, I'm just playing as, as Wonder Woman to get a feel for the character. Maybe try to get her to level 15 or whatever. And then we'll go from there. So they have a Tasmanian Devil. Yikes. Taz has a crazy ability.
Oh, geez, there it is again. It's actually quite strong. But he's dead now. Now he's invisible. This invisible Taz stuff is broken, dude. I don't like it at all. I'm just getting killed now. God, we're gonna lose because it's invisible tad. <sighs> yeah, we got the smash music, I don't care. Uh, this game does have copyrighted music in it, which really sucks. Uh, there's a glitch in the game right now. Um, I don't know why, but it makes it makes Taz invisible for no reason. Um, I, I just don't understand. We're going to get that rematch going. I could team with you. What level are you? It doesn't matter what level you are. I just kind of want to know. I got some good perks. Look at that, 50 melee attacks. Wow, so th these, this is how you get everything unlocked. Two matches with an assassin class character. I am not an assassin. This is a tank. Yeah, I have, I have music turned off. Completely. So I figured we gotta have something playing in the background. Smash music. I want to have video game music in my streams. And Smash music is video game music, so it's not really necessarily Smash, it's just video game. I've got Street Fighter music in this playlist also. A bunch of other stuff. It's just going to play the majority of Smash because there's a thousand songs in the Smash <laughs> in the Smash arena of music. But it's all good. Alright, so we're not dealing with Taz anymore. That's good. Missions and in game currency. That is correct. Ugh. Oh jeez, what is happening to me? Get off of me. I feel like dodges are kind of overpowered. 
not overpowered, but they're definitely something that can get you the upper hand. It looks like you can dodge like in the middle of a combo. My guy died? Shaggy. Shaggy! Me! I can't even touch him. We won! Let's go! Let's go! Whew. That's the best two out of three also. That's tight. Auto party forming? Let's go. Let's go, Shaggy. I'm okay with it. That was cool, man. I'm surprised we, like, I thought we were, like, way behind, and we were going to need, like, three KOs without dying. We must have just got it. Nice. Ring out an enemy who is less than 60 damage. That's going to be tough. Alright, so we're going to be Wonder Woman again. What's this? Oh, the battle pass? I'll look at that later. The one thing I don't like about this right now is that the, the menus are so slow. If they could just change the menus to be not so slow, I'd be okay. And maybe it's because it's on my hard drive and not the actual... Or it's on like an external hard drive, so maybe that's the problem, but... I guess I can try to put it on the regular um, hard drive and see what happens. But yeah, it's cool. The game's fun, man. The game is really cool. Tetris type B. We got PC players over here. Shaggy's scared. I ain't scared. I ain't scared. We only lost one. And we still won the best of three, so we're good. 
We'll be all right. Four ring outs. What the heck? This team's got some perks, man. I can't even get a hit. I can't touch them at all. This is what I was afraid of with like perks and stuff. Oh, jeez, no. Lost. Defeat. We almost had a comeback. I don't like... I don't like... That matchup was not fun. That's all I'm saying. Like, I'm in, Scoob. Oof. I'm kind of hungry. I don't know what to do. I feel like I need to get something to eat. But I don't know what. I was thinking about this all day. I haven't eaten anything. Because I'm like, man, I want something, like... It's going to last me. But I don't know what. Neutral attack 30 times. <laughs> like a giant sandwich? No. Maybe. No. Like when you say that I think I think Jimmy John's, but I don't want Jimmy John's. Yeah, Shaggy should be doing all the damage here. He's level 13, he's way higher than both of them. I was thinking Chinese, but I don't even know if I want Chinese. Like I do, but I don't. I don't know what I want from there. I know it'd be good. I know it'd fill me up. I, I, oh, I know it would be amazing. Oh, jeez. They got two now.
Oh, I didn't know. Ah, I lost track of where I was, dude. Holy crap. Yeah, that was bad. That was really bad. Dagwoods? <laughs> now they'd be called Shaggies. That was a rough match. I did not like that. disband this party I mean I did lose track of where I was and basically SD'd so it's probably my fault if anything but still alright so we got the battle pass we got some things to unlock this thing lady unicorn just claim all uncle shagworthy Nice. Got the new ring out. A ring out's badge. Jake Wink emote. Cool. Five extra toasts. Yeah, more experience. That's okay. The Mascara banner. I guess you get six missions. I want to level her up to, to 15 before I... change. Choose your character. Oh, there we go. I don't want to get Batman, though. I want Superman. Nope, not that one. Cool. Maybe I'll try to play Superman. I do like me some Superman, though. So. Maybe I will do just that. Choose your character. God, this is so sluggish. Match found. Alright, we got a new, we got a Harley with us this time. Harley's scary to me, I don't know why. Fire projectile, ice projectile. Huh. Those seem to be pretty good. I feel like those are going to be like the new meta. Mooprasan! Fixing some stuff on my TV. Oh, you just started? <laughs> That's cool. I think I've been playing for just a couple hours so far. Not very much. I feel comfortable with it though. I, mean, I guess coming from Smash, it's not like a different, it's not wildly different. Like it's kind of easy to adapt. Is there no like, do they not say like, get ready, go? Do they not have character intros or anything? I feel like we just started. Okay. Okay. What the heck? Was there armor there? What is happening? This is not even playable. What's going on? Point. Red team. 
This is fun for them? What What's happening? This is bad, dude. Oh my god. Is that what happens when you lag switch? When you throttle your your data? That's bad. We're not we're not rematching them. Holy crap, dude. I almost want to block them. Like I'm sure whoever was doing the lagging saw everything on their screen normally. But because of the rollback netcode, everything was super laggy for me. And now I don't know what's going on. Just close it, I guess. That was so weird. Like, I sure hope that doesn't count. Because... <laughs> I don't even know if I started strong really because I felt like the game like the game loaded it was like I was seeing the game and it was just going like I feel like I was already late to the party and I couldn't hit anybody there was a couple of like armor frames that I think I got caught up in and then punished for it I don't know Imagine though if like third parties came into this and it wasn't just WB. Imagine if like Capcom wanted to jump in. Because I think as of right now there's no limitation on, on what characters they could or could not use. I think people were talking about like Neo jumping in. That'd be pretty cool. Be alright with that. What's this? Oh, a new character. Right? What is this? A new reward. The Grapple of Hermes. Announcer pack for Wonder Woman? That'd be cool. Okay. so weird I think I'm gonna turn the air back on though because it's really hot in here and I can't really take my shirt off either because it's green shirt that I have underneath and that ain't gonna work oh that's true Capcom has done Marvel stuff I imagine it probably be uh, Mortal Kombat stuff. Oh, we've got we got to increase damage for aerial attacks. Hit me if you're able. Prepare yourself. That's a goal. Yeah, there is, there is kind of a... Ah! Like a startup. Oh, that's not good.
Jesus. Yikes. We'll get this, we'll get this. My god. Yikes. Ah! I can't even hit him. God, I can't hit him at all. Ah! I, I can't hit anybody right now. Oh, nice. There we go. All right. I, I must have spiked him with a forward air. I don't know how that happened. Molly Molly Moon, what is going on? Welcome to the stream. Siesta Sunday. Sunday chill stream. New game, Multiverses, free to play, coming out next month. And I got early access, thanks to my good buddy, Bosk. Todd. maybe you've heard of him, maybe you've seen him around. Just woke up from a nap. I was going to message you, and I figured you're probably napping. I gotta use that more often. I gotta remember to use it. The grapple. Straight napping. Do you mean as opposed to gay Prepare napping? Yourselves. Is there a difference? I don't know. I don't know. This is on PlayStation, Xbox, and PC. Cross-platform play. So you can do whatever you want. Play however you want. Um... Nice, dude. He got that KO. I didn't see it. Dude, I just did a sick-ass combo. Yikes. Taz is pretty cool. He's glitched right now. Uh, you can be invisible. I just died. Oh my god. Good job. Uh, I didn't do anything on that. I just killed myself. <laughs> T 
Taz is pretty cool, man. My sister liked Taz a lot growing up. Um, one of our friends, one of one of our like family friends, he's. Don't take this the wrong way, because it doesn't relate to you at all, but he's kind of not smart. Not not for this reason, for a lot of other reasons, but um, he had a Tasmanian Devil tattooed on his back. It was Taz, like, holding two submachine guns. And that's fine if that's what you're into. I have no problem with the tattoo. He's, he's dumb for other reasons. So, I don't say that a lot about people. I don't like talking about people behind their back. I just, he was, he's a friend of the family. He's been a friend of the families for so long. And I just, uh, I couldn't, like, hang out with them. Because I felt like I was the smartest person in the room. I think that's what it boiled down to. There's a lot of other reasons, but I think that's what it boiled down to. Level 2 Shaggy. Taz is pretty funny, though. I, I like him as a character. I was always a fan of Bugs Bunny. I feel like... Um, for those of us that grew up in the 90s with Daffy Duck and uh, Bugs Bunny... I'm pretty sure a lot of us have, like, smart-ass attitudes because of that cartoon. I just have a feeling that that's a big part of why I'm such a smart-ass. anything. Dude, she's like, she's insane. Look at me. No! What is that? I just got busted. Oh my god. I don't even know what the hell that was. I've never seen that happen before. Did we knock out any of them? We knocked out one of them. What is that? Oh my god.
got it. We got it. All right. <laughs> Man, this guy Finn is good. <laughs> he's a good. He's a good player. I like playing with him. They're on the SNES, the um, Daffy Duck Marvin missions. I've not played that. Or Bugs Bunny Rabbit Rampage. Nope. Yeah, it's free. It's a free game, and it, it can be fun. I think there's a, there's a competitive aspect to it, so if you're not like a competitive person, there might be a, a bit of a struggle, but I think, you know, it can be fun. Especially for free, you know. Pay no money, play with your friends, have fun. You know, that's basically how it goes. Um, but no, I never played those games on Super Nintendo. I feel like I, I strayed away from the Looney Tunes games. Um, Prepare I don't know why. Yourself. I couldn't tell you. It just never really looked like something I'd want to play. But I did play the Bart Simpson games, the the Simpsons on the NES. Those were pretty fun. They're not really the same, but they were cool. Oh, she died. Oh, my God. I wonder if I got that, and I wonder if it was under 30 or under 60%. <laughs> she saved me. Thanks. Oh, I died. Game. We got it. We did it! This game is like... I don't know. When you're winning, it's really fun. It's like every other every other game. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Party bonus. That's what's up. It's a party over here. It's a party over there. Oh, nice. I did a ring out with uh, less than 60 damage. That's awesome. I was hoping that would happen. Nice. I don't have an assassin. I wonder if I can uh, just change that, change that mission to something else. I'll play an assassin if I have to. I just don't want to. Okay, cool. We'll do this one. That's easy. I am hungry, though. I think I need to get some, order some food. I'm really hungry. Uh, they got the Adventure Time theme. We got the Girls of DC theme. Let's go. Oh, she's level three. Oh man, this guy's level two though. Jake, Finn is level seven. I'm level ten, so this should be good.
Yeah. I like Harley's design in this. She's got kind of a mixture of like the old Batman animated series mixed with like Margot Robbie and um, I don't know what else. But she's cool looking. Let's go, Finn. Oh, geez, I walked right into that. So cool. What the hell was that? Yikes. Dude, Jake, get off me. That's the wrong button. Whoops. <laughs> Zoinks! I, uh, I did just try to attack my teammate, so maybe I'm not the best person at this game. Let's get Finn, let's get him. himself why'd he sd he was so done dude jake was just like i'm out of here man i'm done i feel like they had a pretty good shot <laughs> nah i'm good jake's like i'm not playing i'm not playing this anymore he had two ko's I guess everyone's gonna have two KOs at the end of the game, right? Look at that gold I just earned, holy crap. Level up bonus. Nice, new reward. Shield of Athena. All right, three more uh, 2v2 games.
Let's go Harley. Let's get uh, let's get these W's. I really want to get her to level 15. Fighting does not make you a hero. Yeah, no, it makes you a badass. Right? Am I right? Right? That's what the bullies at school would tell me. Bum, 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 bum. Whoops. Alright, let's see. I already have my character. I'm good. I am good, son. Today's been a weird day. I didn't have anything on my schedule today, and I'm sitting here like, what do I do? Like, I just kind of played it by ear today and just did my own thing. I still have to upload some, some videos. I almost forgot. So we're probably going to just do a couple more matches, and then... I will uh, have to come back to this on Tuesday, maybe, because it is fun. Ah. Ah, get over there! Oh my god, I'm just dying all over the place now. How are we on match point? Has Finn never died? Match point. Red team. Nice! I don't know how we won that. I SD'd twice, dude. I can't believe that. Falco V1 is good, man. He's a good player. Play again? He had all four KOs. I didn't do shit. Okay. okay! That is not Superman's voice. I'm sorry. That does not sound like him at all. Okay! Sounds like a little Wayne. Jay Breezy. I don't know. whoever, Whoever's out there making raps now. Rap music. Yeah, I put it in quotations. You know. I guess it counts as a creative art of some kind, but. And I guess it is musical in nature. So, sure. Music. Okay, we got extra melee attack damage on the ground also. Prepare yourselves. Prepare yourselves. Rap can be all right. I mean, there is some rap that I actually like, but a lot of rap these days is like, I call it lazy rap because it's basically just like a really good beat with people just mumbling and saying things like, I went to the Costco for the homie. I got to pay all my money. And I went to in the parking lot. Shorty gonna have me a hobby lot. It's just so boring. Oh 
Oh my god. Dude, Finn is killing it, dude. I died. <laughs> yeah, old, old school hip hop is far superior. Well, they actually tried, and they, they tried to make, like, really good rhymes. Like, if you hit me with a really good rhyme, I'm cool, man. Hit me with a line that's, like, really clever and, like... Yeah, I didn't do anything in that game. <laughs> no, I've got a I've got a playlist on that's playing Zelda music right now. Cause this game has copyright music, so I just turned the music off. I didn't want to risk that. <laughs> so confused. Story of my life. Ooh, almost to level six. Nice. Yeah, Finn's carrying this whole team. I, I'm not doing anything. I appreciate it, though. I will fight for those who cannot fight for themselves. He literally just spiked, like, two... Like, both of them on the right side or the left side of the map, like... It was crazy. I'm over here just pressing buttons and he's over there just getting KOs. And you know, I'm not sucking, so it's good. You know, he's probably okay with being on my team. He's not much higher level than me, although he might have played other characters too. But we'll make this the last one, I think, because I need to get some food. I got to put up some videos and yeah, lots of stuff. So four readouts. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, dude. I haven't hit anybody yet. I haven't done any damage. Okay, I did something. Not that time, though. They just killed my Finn. I can't even go below this freaking... Nice! Finn, get it, bro! Okay, that was a good KO. Finn's actually kind of strong. Maybe I should be using him. Okay, 
I feel like I'm not even really doing any anything like super good right now. It's basically all my teammate. God, no. No, don't kill me. Thanks, Finn. Victory. I just had to survive. I had so much... Um, damage on me. I just had to survive until Finn took that one home for us. I think this is the best two out of three here, though, right? Dude, I'm not doing shit. I'm just a bot. I'm literally just a CPU teammate. <laughs> I wonder why Finn, why his defeat pose is him just like assuming the position. I don't, I hate saying it that way, but I wonder why that's what's going on. Where's Wonder Woman's hair? Bro. Where's her hair? She has no hair, bro. For as well as this game is made, there's a lot of glitches. Which, I guess it's alpha, so of course, there's going to be glitches. I'm sure they'll fix them in patches and updates and stuff, and that's cool. That's what these kind of games are designed for, so I get it. Um, drop frames. Sorry about the drop frames, guys. I don't know what happened there. I got one, guys. I got a KO. No, I didn't. They killed. They killed Finn. He just got two. Dude, I'm not doing anything. This other Finn is just doing forward smashes. I got a KO! I got one! I got another one. That's two. I got the last one. Let's get it. <laughs> Let's get it. That was tight, dude. I gotta leave this group though. I could just get wins all day, but I gotta I gotta go.
Gaia. Level 11. Battle Pass leveled up. Oh, I didn't mean to play again. Damn it, I gotta leave the group. Choose your character. Sorry, Finn. I gotta go. Don't worry, though. You're gonna have a very easy time getting all the KOs with another person. I didn't check, but I'm pretty sure I got two of those KOs. Fairly confident. New rewards. Toasts, weightlifting, total wins, and Themyscira. Nice. New missions in 39 minutes. Interesting. How many levels are there? 50 levels. Who is this? Samurai? Batman variant? Wow. That's cool. Jake Cake variant. Night Banner. Who is that? Oh, it's a banner. Jelly Bean. Ring out. That's really cool. A ring out effect when you die, that happens. That's cool. You know, it just sucks too because, like, as much as I like Smash. They really didn't do much to, like, to move the game forward. Like, they really just kept the game. I, and I think that, you know, getting getting all of the... Like, getting all the, all the characters back for Smash Ultimate was tough, and I, I get that. But there really wasn't any other, like... unlockables it was just like here's the game enjoy it and I, again i think that's fine but it just kind of sucks because there wasn't really any incentive to play it so it became a casual game for me because it wasn't something that i went out of my way to play but i don't know i do enjoy I do enjoy this. This is a really cool game. I have to say, like, it is, it is actually a cool game. And I'm kind of curious to see how, uh, what kinds of things change in the future, what kinds of things they bring out, customization options, KO, KO ring out animations, emotes, things like that. The potential is there. And if only Smash Ultimate had incorporated some of that potential in, in that game, it would have been better. And one thing I like about this is, Crash Bandicoot Racing, the CTR, Crash Team Racing, did something kind of similar to this, where they had like a whole bunch of skins, a whole bunch of wheels, a whole bunch of cart customizations, just all kinds of really cool things that you can unlock. And it was, it was kind of neat, right? But Mario Kart never did that. In a way, and I hate saying this, but in a way, it's leading me to, to this belief that Nintendo is kind of just phoning it in right now. They're not really doing anything to make the game, like, to move their games forward. They're just putting out content. They're putting out a game. But it's not, it's not as good as the game could be, you know? It's like they just kind of, maybe they're focused on too many projects at the same time, or maybe they never thought about you know, seasonal event kinds of things like this before. And before you say Animal Crossing, you're wrong, because Animal Crossing was the wrong the wrong game to do that with. Um, but something like Smash Ultimate or Mario Kart 9, if done like this, really could change the way that the game is. So maybe... I don't know. Maybe we cross our fingers in the future for Nintendo to kind of wake up and start to sniff the roses and go in a direction that, one, can make them more money for things like season passes and just fun stuff, but two, can also 
keep players engaged with the games that they purchased for a long time. Or even just make them free, you know? I think it's time that they kind of restructure or, you know, reevaluate their development structure. But anyway, I um, think I need to go because I need to get some food and this was fun though. This is really cool. So I'd love to do a 12 hour stream of it, but I do have to work tomorrow. I got to put some videos up, got some work to do. So thanks for coming by Molt. Thanks boss. Thanks Molly and uh, Desi the Fox as well. I'll be back on Tuesday with streaming more of this. Give myself a Mario Kart break for a while. But, yeah, thanks, everybody. Have a great night. Take care of yourselves. I'll catch you on the flippity flip.